Origami Warriors here. Uh, we just wanted to give you an update on our schedule and on everything that's happening. So we're hopefully uploading two to three dimes a day. And also, I'm using a microphone now. If you can hear me better now, that's great. And last but not least, we're having a shout out thing where you can if you subscribe, um, like this video, and comment, I subscribe, down below, then we might give you a shout out. So let's get into the Today video. we'll be making a heart box. And what a heart box is, is it's a flat piece of paper with a heart on it. And then when you pull it, it's a box. You can't really store stuff in it, but you can write a message. And if you have super small origami paper, maybe you could hide it in there. To start, you're going to take a square sheet of paper and start on the white side. Now, you fold this way. Corner to corner. Unfold. Fold other corner to corner. Now unfold and you're going to fold one edge into the middle. And the edge on the opposite side of that, so in this case, it would be this side. I mean, sorry, the uh, corner to the middle. Now you have some type of square, square, isosceles triangle, isosceles tri right triangle thing but you're gonna unfold that and take the corner right here and fold it to that crease you just made. So it will look like that. And same on the other side. Now, fold in, in, And then on the other side, in, and in. Now you'll have a long rope type of thing with two squares at the end. Now, you, if you don't have, um, you're gonna fold this edge I mean this corner to the other corner over this way. And you want to make this pretty perfect and then unfold. Now you have a crease in the middle and you're going to take this you're gonna find two, you're gonna pick a side and find two tabs. Take one of the tabs and take the edge of the tab and fold it to that line. Now the other edge, uh, and then get the other tab and fold the edge of that to that line. And then um, collapse it all the way down. Now, you should have a square with one corner folded in. And you fold this back, this back, and, of course, this back. 
now you've you can see this is now split up into two sections the white section and the pink section we're going to take the white section and fold it all the way back now we're going to do the same with the other side i will go faster on this since you guys have already seen this Okay, now you have uh, two white and some pink under it. You're going to pick one side, fold it over, and pull this all the way up. And then take the other corner and just bend it just a little. Then fold it back, and you see you have almost a complete half of the heart. Same on this side, I'm, it's just mirrored. So you fold this back like that, and then this like that, and fold it back. Now it pretty much looks like a heart, except there should be a little bump right there. So what you're gonna do is find that there's a little corner here, and you can f pull it up and then fold it over like that. Same on the other side, mirrored. And then open it up, open each side up, and this is hard. You're gonna, you already have this little fold. You push it back in like that and then all the way down so then we have a little indent right there same on this side you have a crease right here you fold it down and all the way down and now you have your heart and then you can take these two edges of the heart and pull to reveal the box. This is a perfect gift if your parents are having a birthday or if any loving occasion is happening. Um, so yeah, bye guys. Don't forget about um, the shout out challenge. Um, we'll take a picture of of your comment and share it. Bye. Shower,